Hey everybody, you're watching Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works. My name is Gretchen. It's Valentine's Day, February 14th, 2017. This week's topic is about self-love. What does that mean to me? It means taking care of myself, even mentally, beyond the weight loss. Um, self-love is self-preservation. Uh, for me, that means removing myself from a difficult situation if I can't control my emotions. I'm still working on that. My temper is quite known. Um, and uh, I try to abide by what my mother always told me. If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. And that includes posting stuff online. Um, the exception to that rule is I don't avoid or I'm trying not to avoid difficult situations in my weight loss journey. Um, I want to start posting the bad stuff just because it's not all pretty. Um, what, uh, how do you love yourself best? I like massages. I like to treat myself that way. Um, I haven't had one in a really long time. I tried to do it over the winter. Um, there goes the phone again. Um, I tried to do one over the winter, uh, winter break and that did not happen. So I definitely need to get on that. Is it hard for you? Hell yeah, it's hard. Um, I have a six year old, I have a husband, I have a full time job. It's really hard to make time for yourself. It's definitely a conscious effort that I, again, I'm still working on. Um, I was working on this even before weight loss surgery. And at, before weight loss surgery, I didn't think I deserved a lot of that. Um, now as a mom, I think I deserve it. I'd have a massage every day if I could afford it. Um, Self-love is also, to me, taking care of myself. Sleep, I'm a big proponent of sleep. Um, and I'm not just saying that, it's, you know, I try to get my, I try to be in bed by 9.30, um, asleep by 10 for sure. I'm up at 4.30, five, six on the weekends. Um, so I'm a big proponent of sleep, trying to relax, whatever that may be, deep breathing. I take a walk to remove myself from these four walls um, just to kind of clear my head. How has it changed since having weight loss surgery? I feel like I deserve it now more. It's kind of weird that way. Um, I feel like, not that I'm more deserving, but I've earned it. I think we all have. This is the hardest thing I've ever gone through. Um, it's not going to be the last thing I ever go through, but it's definitely a big part of who I am. And I call it more self-preservation because it's preserving the body that I've created. I want to be around for my kid. I want to be around a lot longer than 37 years. And if before weight loss surgery, I don't think I would have been around that long. What tips would you give to a viewer who is struggling to practice self-care, self-love, and truly taking care of themselves? The biggest piece of advice is take one thing. Um, follow your surgeon's orders. That's number one, especially after weight loss surgery. Um, every surgeon has their own opinion. Don't listen to all the advice. It's nice to hear advice and read different opinions, but definitely follow what your surgeon and your nutritionist suggest. Um, take one thing, get yourself a massage for Mother's Day or for finishing a big project at work. Um, take yourself for a pedicure, take yourself for a walk. Um, if you're a little bit further out, get your favorite bottle of wine. Um, make a date with your spouse. That's a huge part of self-preservation and self-love too. You are deserving of love. Whether you're just starting this journey, whether you're a 10 year veteran, whether you're like me and you're just about two years out, the more you take care of yourself up here and here, the better your body will respond. Um, sleep wise, getting your water in. If it's really hard to figure out why you're deserving, make a list. Um, I'm also a big proponent of putting up notes around your house. Put up a before picture. In fact, um, I have a before picture of myself hanging at my desk. It doesn't always work in terms of staying away from the mini chocolates, but it's there as a reminder. Um, I hope everybody has a great Valentine's Day and that you're with the people you want to be with. 
Have a great week and I'll see you next Tuesday. Bye.